Hello friends and fellow flute enthusiasts. I wanted to share a very exciting project with you. Uh, I had hoped to film this video out in the woods and while we're outdoors, we're still under a pavilion. Uh, it's been very wet and rainy here in Iowa the last few days and it looks like it's not going to let up anytime soon. So here we are in a pavilion out in the woods. Um, but I wanted to share this flute with you. This is a flute that John Norris, a flute maker in North Carolina, and I have collaborated on. Uh, the name of this flute is The Heart of Healing Bear. And I'll tell you a little bit about the flute, but uh, what I want to share with you now is uh, the specs of the flute. So the body of the flute is made from Spanish cedar. It has a roasted poplar end cap here for the mouthpiece maple between uh, the poplar and the body of the flute made of Spanish cedar. So there's that maple ring there. Down at the foot of the flute, we have some um, engraving here. There's some geometric designs here on the body of the flute. Then up here, we have the Zuni bear. So again, pulling back into the bear theme here. And then one other feature that I really love about this flute is the block itself. The block is um, made from many different uh, kinds of woods layered together, but you get this nice full moon um, in the mountains. And it really, if you look at the cover, um, cover art for Moon Songs, an album that I put out uh, several years ago, it has the same uh, feature with it. And so it pulls from some of the music that I wrote during a really dark part of my life. I turned to music and music became a vehicle where I could take some of the, the bad feelings or the heartbreak or um, just, the, ah, just the tough stuff and to put it into music. And so I wanted to honor that again in this um, signature flute. And so here it's been uh, you can see my signature here that's been engraved. And also um, here we have uh, John Norris's um, engraving here. And then it's hard to see, but um, the key of the flute is also engraved in the mouthpiece. Now another special touch that I requested and John fully delivered on this was uh, with these little hearts in the back of the flute. And what these are is kind of just another connection point of where your thumbs might go, realizing that everyone's thumbs are a little bit different and how you hold the flute might be a little different, but still just another um, thoughtful, um, thoughtful little um, idea here where you can put your thumbs to connect more with the flute as well. So you're probably curious how it sounds and we'll get to that right now. Very beautiful, warm sound. It's tuned to the key of F minor, so it's between E minor and F sharp minor, which are both really common flute or common keys for the flute. Now, the this signature flute also comes with a very special bag. Um, Deb Mauser, a friend of mine, is incredible with a sewing machine, and so we work together on a special bag for this flute as well. So one of the features that I really like is the angled um, flap of the lid of this bag. It has a snap underneath, so it closes by um, a snap here. And then from here we have a grommet in it and it has a few little piece of leather, um, a stone bear and a bear claw um, pendant here that hang from it as well a shoulder strap 
and knowing that this bag fits for this particular flute I have put a couple of other smaller flutes in the bag with it um, you'll just want to add a fleece um, sock or a little fleece bag to put those in so your flutes don't bang together um, but fits very comfortably this comes with the flute itself these are a limited number and they retail at $3.95 so you'll find links for that in the description below uh, that'll take you over to my website where you'll find some more photos of this beautiful flute but um, a job well done for um, both John Norris and Deb Mauser to bring this vision that I had for a flute and bag to life so thank you both very much for that and uh, if you're interested in learning more about this flute or adding one like it to your collection, uh, see the links below. Thanks so much. We'll talk to you soon.